Okay, so Orlando vacation day one uh, is in the bag. Um, not without its, I guess, complications or frustrations. Um, let's see, what, what did we do today, Liz? We sat on a plane from Seattle to Orlando for four and a half hours, which feel like it felt like it wouldn't end ever. But we got there early. Yes, we, we did. We got there about a half hour earlier than anticipated. Mm -hmm. This is good, except the only problem with that is we had to spend the next 10 hours roaming around Orlando looking for things to do. We spent the first, what, three or four just roaming around the airport looking no. at... We called our Uber about nine, so Yeah, yeah, that yeah, okay, so yeah, we called our we called our Uber about nine o'clock and said, Hey, we're we're bored, come get us and a uh, really nice guy, name is uh Francisco and uh yeah, uh got us to our hotel here which we just finally got our room about an hour ago. Well, check in wasn't till four. We were early. Yeah, well you know, whatever. Um so yeah, we, we got here, he, he dropped us off, and then we kind of kind of ran around downtown, or not downtown Orlando, but just here on University, on Universal, Universal Drive and, and, and International yeah, Drive. International Drive, just looking for things to do, tr looking at different attractions. We uh, played around on the uh, Orlando Eye, which was pretty cool. Um, I didn't realize Florida was quite that flat. Um, we're used to seeing a lot more mountains on a particular side of us. Um, so I'm, I'm usually pretty good with where I am in sense of like north, south, east, west. I have no idea where I'm at right now. But I knew where we she, were. Yeah, she does. A human compass over here. Um, so yeah, we did the Orlando Eye. Um, that was cool. Um, we walked around the, what was it, the, the aquarium? Yeah, the Sea Life Aquarium. It's right next door. There's a cluster. There's the Orlando Eye, Sea Life Aquarium, Madame Tussauds, and Legoland are all like linked up by somebody probably owns all four of them. Around here, probably one person. Well, because you can bundle the prices. So. Yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, the, the aquarium was cool. Saw a lot of fish, sharks, octopus, whatever. Uh, we, were, we were originally planning on going to SeaWorld, but we found that the ticket of one or the price of one SeaWorld ticket uh, would be the same as going to the Orlando Eye, the Aquarium, and uh, Madame Tussauds. So we we opted to go for the latter. We we're also exhausted, so playing yeah. at SeaWorld seemed like a lot of work. Yeah, that's the other <laughs> thing. I'm I'm going on probably 30 plus hours of no sleep. Um, got up at 4 a.m. yesterday to go to work. So did I. So, you, yeah, that's true. Um, no, you you had yesterday off. I know, but I was oh, awake. Oh, yeah, you were awake with me. Okay, so <laughs> all right, so that counts. Um, so yeah, get got off work, didn't sleep on the plane from Boise to Seattle, but don't really need to because it's like an hour and fifteen minutes. So when we got to Seattle, it was three and a half hours of doing laps around the airport. We 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 really did do a couple of laps on the on the underground shuttle system. That was kind of cool. Um, and then yeah, we left Seattle uh, around 11 o'clock Pacific time, um, and then flew flew here to Orlando. Uh, so yeah, we're getting ready to head out again after a day of trying to find stuff to kill the time. We. Uh, it was more exploring. We weren't really bored. It yeah. Kind of like, ooh, what's over here? Let's. Yeah. We're going this way now. Well, I mean, this is the first time either one of us have been on the East Coast in any, any capacity. So, yeah, I mean, it's cool to to walk around and and kind of see what, what they have versus what we don't. Right. Um, I didn't realize how many trees there were going to be. That is true. Which, yeah. I know uh, that there are the Everglades. So. Yeah. Yeah. Huh. Um. Huh. Yeah. Huh. Yeah. The the amount of trees really did surprise me. Um, it reminds us a lot of Germany, which was really surprising, um, which is cool. We love Germany, and we might learn to love Florida. I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, we saw the uh, convention center where Celebration is going to be held. It's massive. It is insanely huge. Um, we could see it from the uh, Orlando Eye, and I, I didn't anticipate just how big it was. Um, 
so tomorrow will be interesting. Um, our original plan was to see if we could line up at the convention center at around 5 a.m. tomorrow morning to get the wristbands for the 40th uh, anniversary panel and uh, do the same thing the next morning for The Last Jedi. But from what I've been hearing online, um, the lines have already started, people are already camping out, and I'm too damn tired to deal with any of that crap right now. So tomorrow morning is going to be kind of a wing it sort of deal. If we get to the panel, great. If not, well, thank God for YouTube, because <laughs> I'm sure it'll have like a trillion views for whatever they announce. It's kind of a big secret right now. So. Uh, we're gonna head out get some dinner because we've been nibbling on pretzels and water and uh, Actually, we did f find that that shake and what is it shake and shack? Shake shack shake shack. That was actually really good that you know, I'll, I'll give this to the south They know how to deep fry batter. I am not kidding. You my, just know my how to fry everything. That, yeah, that's true my, my chicken sandwich was was awesome so we're gonna go hit up Joe's crab shack just literally feet from our hotel uh many a cocktail uh i'm gonna get my my shark attack on shark, shark bite shark bite whatever yeah, I'm, what uh, well yeah um clams the whole nine so we're gonna chow on seafood and see what tomorrow has in store and we will go from there